Astronomy has been a fascinating subject for humans since ancient times. In Ireland, astronomy has a rich history with several observatories and astronomical societies dedicated to the study of the cosmos. In this video, we'll be looking at astronomy in Ireland, its history, and some of the latest developments in the field. Ireland has a long tradition of astronomy, dating back to the ancient Celts who used the stars to navigate and mark the passage of time. During the medieval period, Irish monks made significant contributions to astronomy, such as the measurement of the length of the year, which was used to calculate the date of Easter. However, it wasn't until the 18th and 19th centuries that modern astronomy began to take shape in Ireland. One of the most prominent figures in Irish astronomy was William Rowan Hamilton, who made significant contributions to mathematical physics, including the development of quaternions, a mathematical system used in the study of rotations and orientations in space. Another notable Irish astronomer was Agnes Mary Clarke, who wrote a book on the history of astronomy that is still considered a classic in the field. And there was Annie Maunder, the lady computer of Straban, who studied sunspot cycles and gave her name to the Maunder Minimum, a period of reduced solar activity from 1645 to 1715. Today, Ireland has several observatories, including the Armagh Observatory and the Dunsink Observatory, which are both affiliated with universities. The Armagh Observatory, founded in 1790, is one of the oldest observatories in the world and is home to a range of telescopes used for research and public outreach. The Dunsink Observatory, located in Dublin, was established in 1785 and is known for its contributions to study of comets, asteroids and other celestial objects. There is also the Black Rock Castle Observatory in Cork and the Leviathan Telescope in Burr, built by Lord Ross in 1845, having a 6-foot or 72-inch diameter mirror. This was the largest telescope in the world for 72 years until it was overtaken by the 100-inch telescope on Mount Wilson in California in 1917. It is credited with the first identification of Messier 51 as a spiral galaxy, the Whirlpool Galaxy. In addition to these observatories, there are several astronomical societies in Ireland, such as the Irish Astronomical Society in Dublin, the Irish Astronomical Association in Belfast, and a number of smaller clubs and societies that come together under the umbrella of the Irish Federation of Astronomical Societies. These societies host public lectures, stargazing events, and other outreach activities to promote interest in astronomy. One of the most exciting developments in Irish astronomy in recent years has been the discovery of exoplanets, planets that orbit stars outside of our solar system. In 2019, a team of Irish researchers, led by Dr Eamon Kerins from the University of Manchester, discovered a new exoplanet using data from the Kepler Space Telescope. The planet, which is about twice the size of Earth, is located in the habitable zone of its star where conditions may be suitable for life. So, astronomy has a rich history in Ireland, with several observatories and astronomical societies dedicated to the study of the cosmos. Irish astronomers have made significant contributions to the field over the years, and the country continues to play a vital role in modern astronomy, with exciting discoveries being made all the time. Whether you are a professional astronomer or just someone who is curious about the universe, Ireland is a great place to explore the wonders of the cosmos.